2020 is almost over. What a crazy year this has been. I hope it's been a safe year for you. It's definitely been challenging for a lot of artists uh, that I know, and myself included. The good thing is that we opened up this gallery just a few weeks ago, and you are welcome to come and visit sometime. Uh, we actually all sign calendars or prints here. Um, but let me give you a little tour of the 2021 calendar. So we could just turn the page for 2020 into 2021. <laughs> all right, we have January. January is winter chickens. My daughter's friend Ivy loves chickens. She's got, I think she's got about 12 of them. These are three of them. I love chickens. They are fun. They're pretty and they're even delicious, right? Everybody loves chicken, unless you're a vegetarian. But there's something about chickens that they're just fun to look at. So I also want to put this in a winter scene just to make it different. It's, you don't usually see chickens in the winter time. I do have a spring version of this called Spring Chickens. So check that out too. February is Blue and orange lobster buoys. This is a really neat image, I think. First of all, you don't see blue and orange very often as a lobster buoy. And it's very directional, it has motion, and it's very abstract looking and simple. And uh, I like just the way the directions are going of the buoys. Lobstering at the Nubble. This is the March image. This is the official bicentennial image of Maine. And unfortunately, because of COVID, things were different this year, but uh, I'm very proud of this image and it represents Maine well. We have the flag and the state flag there as well. April is Alewives on the Move. Now we have uh, the Kennebec River right, right this way. You can actually see it from here. And it's the largest river in Maine, 200 miles. And Alewives are coming coming back after 300 years of having three dams up this Cobbacy stream here. They're all coming back and it's wonderful. They've come back from different places in Maine by the millions and it just cleanses the lakes and rivers. It's a wonderful thing. So I wanted to honor these Alewives. I like how simple this is, but it's a flowing image, different colors. And that's, that's a challenge to so keep it simple, but interesting as well. And I just love the feeling in these colors. Things are moving, things are flowing. May is springtime. And springtime in Cadia, that's a pretty place to be. This one's a great one. It's very peaceful. It's hikers in Acadia National Park. This is actually Jordan Pond. And called, these hills are called the Bubbles in Acadia. And if you're familiar with it, it's a beautiful place to go. You could hike around all around the lake. And I just thought to have these Hikers just just relaxing and just enjoying nature. And that's what I love about this image. Hoist a sail. This red sail with a couple and their dog. I think it's just a classic main moment. Just a fun image, you know? You're in the harbor, you're hoisting your sail, small little boat. And um, I thought it was appropriate for June. Main lobster. If you don't like lobster, I kind of feel sorry for you because it's delicious, right? And you also need butter with that. And I always use a little white or two or three or four. But Maine lobster ain't nothing better. Just kind of says it all. Go jump in a lake. One of the funnest things to do as a kid is just go crazy and jump in the lake in the summertime and just enjoy the water. And I love this. This is my kids jumping in. And I love that it's like going for it. It's limitless. It's exciting. It's fun. And uh, it has a lot of connotations for, for life and, as well. So that's what I love about this image. And it's colorful. So I hope you like it too. Painting in Acadia National Park. When I came to visit, uh, this is Otter Cliff in Acadia. There were two painters outside painting away and plein air. I, I really respect painters who could actually sit there and just paint for a few hours and just nail it. Uh, I just wanted to capture the spirit 
of artists. And it's fun, it was beautiful, it was in September. So what better way to capture Acadia than with an artist painting? Sunset Scooters and Camden Harbor. Have you ever been to Camden? It's such a beautiful area. Mount Batty is where I took some pictures. It's the highest point in Camden Harbor. It looks down in the harbor. And during the Windjammer Festival, all these Windjammers come in and schooners come in and they do tours. So I just wanted to capture this openness, the simplicity. Camden's such a beautiful place. It's what a prettiest village in Maine, they say. Up on Mount Batty, you could overlook the whole harbor and see all the historic schooners. So it's worth checking out. November is Cafe in Gardner. Just a few feet away from us is the cafe, Bitless Cafe. It's a great place. And I just wanted to get a scene of Gardner in my calendar. December is Winter at Portland Headlight. And I love this one because you got snow on one end of the roof and on the other hand, the snow has fallen. Maybe the wind was blowing, but even the color of the sky is kind of like this icy feel to it. So it's chilly, but it's actually kind of comforting in a way. And you don't see Portland headlight in the snow very often. So I just wanted to do something different. So I hope you enjoyed my little tour of the 2021 calendar. Can't you wait? I can't wait myself to get to 2021. And I hope you enjoyed all these images. And come on into the store, to the gallery. I'm here most of the time, especially during the holidays. I'll sign the calendars for you, personalize it to your friends and family. So I hope you come down. We've got Rennie's next door. We've got a brewery next door. And it's a fun place. If not, you could always buy it online. It's free shipping. And thanks for your time. See you again.